Hi, welcome back. In this session, we are going to discuss about indexing in three dimensional number array. So indexing is nothing but we are selecting one element from the numpy array. So for that, I imported the numpy library using import numpy as np and I created a three dimensional numpy array by entering the elements manually and I assign that to a variable x. So when I'm typing x, we got the numpy array of this one. And this is the pictorial representation of the numpy array which we created. This is the first layer, 221, 11, 687 and 111, 12. That is the first layer here. This is the first layer. And this is the second layer. So 4, 9, 14, this one. So few elements are not visible here, which is behind this. And this is the third layer, 14, 27 and uh, up to 44, 50 and 44. So we have three layers. Also, you can use the np.range function to create a three-dimensional numpy array, but uh, to but to make it understand, I just uh, created a random numbers here. So I'll just quickly show that how to create that. So if I'm x equal to n np.range and 27, sorry, 27, I got the x i got created with 27 elements now i am resizing it so dot resize 3 by 3 by 3 so it's a three dimensional matrix and if i'm taking so we got a continuous number this is 1 2 3 up to 26 but uh, to make it more distinctive i created a random numbers here so for this session i'm using this but you can also create this and you can use this one uh, for the further practices so i'm using this numpy array so this is the position now i am decided to select this 11 or extract this 11 from this three dimensional numpy array so for that as we discussed in two dimension also we know we need to understand the position of that element in that numpy array so first of all the 11 is in which position so that means if you are seeing the 11 is in layer wise it is in the first layer or the zeroth layer that means when we are checking the layers th this is the layer 0 this is the layer 1 and this is the layer 2 so that means this the element 11 is in layer 0 so first we need to trim this layer out from the whole three dimensional numpy array so the comment is x is this one suppose from the x is the, this one so the 11 is here in this cell this layer so first layer so we need to trim this layer out or in the pictorial representation this layer out so what the command is x of the position of that layer the position of that layer is zero and this is the first layer this is the second layer so if i'm selecting x of zero so i got 221 11 6, 8, 7, 6, 8, 7. so that means the first element first layer of the numpy uh, array that means this numpy array Suppose if I am giving x of 1, it will give the second layer, this 494 uh, 4, 9, 4 and this layer. And if I am giving x of 2, I will give the, I will get the third layer here. So now the 11 element is in the 0th layer, so I am selecting 0. Now it become a two-dimensional array. Two-dimensional array means we trim this two-dimensional out. Now in two-dimensional array, what is the method? First, we will index the row or which row the element is. So the element 11 is in second row. That means this is the first row. Sorry, this is the zeroth row. This is the first row and this is the second row. So the next is we using this x of 0, we trim this whole thing out. Now from that, we are selecting the row. Now it become a two dimensional matrix and we are selecting the row here. So zero. So I'm just putting to understanding, make it in the a different line. So X of zero, then I'm selecting the row. That means X of zero, then comma two. So I got this row or this row, this row I got trimmed out or in the picture representation, we can see this row I got trimmed out. Now in this row, now it become a one dimensional array, 1, 11 and 12. In that, which one we need? We need 11. So in that, in one dimensional array, how it is indexing? This is zeroth position, first position and second position. So in this, we need X of 11. We need, then we have a comma and the 11th position is one. That means zero one so i type one or better understanding i will get a new line here so x of 
0 and 2. I got this one. And then the next to index 11, I would 0 and first position, that is 1. So I got 11 here. So this is the method to index in three dimension. We can, if you want to index some other digit, for example, I want to index 8 from here. So what is the method? First, I will index this layer. So x of, what is the layer of 8 is x of 0, x of 0. So I got the first layer, then which row it is 0 and first row. So then 0 and 1. So I got this layer 6, 8 and 7. In 6, 8 and 7, 8 is in which layer? That means, uh, sorry, which column? 0 and first. So then again. comma 1. So we got 8 here. This one we got index. Suppose I want to index one more. Suppose I want to index 9 from here or 9 from here. So 9 is in which layer? 9 is in second, first layer. So x of 1 I got. Then x of 1 and from 9 is which row it is? 0 through. So this is a 0 through. The first top one is 0 through. So 0. So I got 4, 9, 4. Then again, it is in which column? Z 0 and first. So first column. So I got 9 here. So that's all about uh, basic concept about the three dimensional indexing in NumPy.